Hi, I'm Dr. Jamie Kulgist. I'm an acupuncturist. I'm a professor and clinician here at SCU, and today we're going to be talking about how to improve your sleep with acupressure. Acupressure is stimulating specific points on the body, uh, usually with a light massage technique. They follow specific points uh, designated by traditional Chinese medicine. Um, we can access them with needling, which is acupuncture, or we can apply pressure, which is acupressure. Acupressure can help you alleviate mild to moderate symptoms at home, um, can help you manage some pain conditions like headaches, um, can help with anxiety, and can also help with sleep. With acupressure for sleep, we recommend stimulating the points about 30 minutes before you go to bed as part of your bedtime routine, just to help you ease into sleep easier. The first point is the most classical point for helping insomnia is called anmyan, which means peaceful sleep. It's located behind the ear. To find it, you'll find the bony prominence right behind the ear. You'll feel that bump and go underneath it about one inch. You should feel a tender spot. This is where the muscle of your neck called the sternocleidomastoid meets the head and push into that tender spot for about 30 seconds. You can make little circles and you can do it on both sides. The second point is heart seven, which is also called Shen Men, which means spirit gate. And it is located on the pinky side of the wrist, right at the wrist crease. So again, you'll push in right underneath the bone, underneath where your pinky finger is. And again, just little circles or light pressure for about 30 seconds. And you can do it on the other side as well. The last acupressure point we're going to do for sleep is called spleen six or san yin jiao, uh, which means three yin crossing, which refers to the meridians of the leg and where they cross at the ankle. It's located about three inches above your ankle. You'll find that bony prominence on the inside of your ankle. Um, and you can measure by measuring your fingers across like this, which should be about three inches up on the ankle. And again, press little circles or light pressure for 30 seconds and you can do it on the other side. With Spleen 6, Sun Yin Zhao, this is not recommended for use by pregnant women, particularly in the first trimester. Um, so we recommend not stimulating this point if you are pregnant, especially in the first trimester. Um, another way to activate this point and help with your sleep is by soaking your feet. So you can soak your feet in warm water or nice warm uh, water with some Epsom salts. Um, dry off very quickly while your feet are still warm, put on some socks and get in nice and cozy in bed and just drift off to sleep. Those are three easy acupressure points you can activate at home to help ease your sleep. If your symptoms are significant or persisting, please contact your medical professional to seek further advice. Acupuncture is also another modality you can seek out and try uh, to see if it can improve your sleep symptoms.